In Parshas Va'era, we read the Arba Lashonos Shel Geula, the four expressions of redemption, V'hitzesi, V'hitzalti, V'ga'alti, V'lekachti. Like many numbered patterns in Jewish thought, this set of four redemptive elements corresponds to other sets of four as well. Two of the many sets to which the Arba Lashonos correspond are the four exiles, Babel, Madai, Yavan, and Edom, as well as the Arba Maros, the four humors or biles mentioned in the Zara Kadesh, Mara Chivra, Mara Sumka, Mara Yeruka, and Mara Shchora, white, red, green, and black biles that impact our emotions. Am Yisrael is currently in the throes of the final of the four exiles, Galos Edom. Doesn't take a sociology degree to recognize that one of the primary characteristics of our social climate is anxiety, emotional numbness, brokenness, confusion, and debilitating sadness and fear. The Tush Reb explains that the reason for this is quite simple. When we look at the alignment of this exile with the elements in the corresponding sets of four, this gullus parallels Marashchora, the black bile of depression and despair. Marashchora, the curse of hopelessness in all of its manifold expressions, is the single greatest challenge facing our generation, the primary battlefront before the coming of Mashiach. Thankfully, the third corresponding set of four is a set of terms relating to redemption. The tzaddik teaches that the final element in this set mirrors the Marashchora of Galus Edom and illuminates the key to our redemption from the darkness within, the Lakach li la'am, and I will take you as my nation. It's fairly intuitive that this reference to Hashem taking us as his nation is describing our acceptance of the Torah on Har Sinai. But based on what we've learned, there is a deeper level here as well. David HaMelech refers to the mitzvahs as Pikude Hashem Yisharim Mesam Chelei V'lakach di Am. It is the everlasting joy of a conscious, passionate, and personal engagement with the Torah and its wisdom that serves as the redemptive antidote for the Marashchor of Galus Edom. Friends, may we merit for the Torah lifestyle we lead and the expanded consciousness it helps foster, saturate every fiber of our being with the life-giving waters of hope, positivity, and joy that will enable us to overcome the deep sadness of our times, the final hurdle before the coming of Mashiach. Wishing all of Am Yisrael a restful, elevated, and meaningful Shabbos Kodesh.